Hello there everybody, Embrix here with multiple kind of figure display stands as I said I'd review. I just reviewed the kind of extra figure stand, though now I am reviewing um, the actual stands. Uh, this is for uh, from Star Wars, Lego Star Wars, The Empire. So I was initially going to do one separate video on each one, but then I realized, you know, this is small and you'd get bored. So I just bring it to you all together, all my Imperial Force, just pushing it all out there. Um, so, um, by the way, I forgot to mention in the extra figs video, if there is a figure that's massable, the Stormtrooper, uh, for instance, I wouldn't include it in the extra figures because, you know, uh, it's a good army builder. I'd like, I'd like to have like seven of those three layered stands just filled with regular generic Stormtroopers. That would be great. But uh, let's get um, into it, starting with this one over here. That's kind of from Rogue One. I just got, uh, it's very simple, all of these are done in black with black plates underneath, then some just black um, bricks um, placed and, you know, one uh, higher than the other, I guess. So I got two Death Troopers and Director Krennic. Um, so here's the other kind of, this is probably the least interesting one just because it's droids and, you know, you can only say so much about droids, but you got, uh, this is actually official from the advent calendar, but you got a dark one and then one that has a C-3PO base, just looks weird to me. Here you have a white droid, a black protocol droid, um, interrogation droid, a mouse droid, that's important, and a droid from kind of Darth Vader's uh, transfiguration set, forgot the official name for that. Um, uh, let's take a look at this then, the military force. So you got um, five stormtroopers, just regular, though some are older, these two, or three, than these, the other two. And in the middle, I have a colored kind of red um, special, if you will, uh, stormtrooper. I got some gunners there, right there on the two corners, then Death Star gunners right there and there. And then I have a kind of general, here we go. I have a kind of general back there. And um, I have space for one more kind of general like that with that sort of helmet right there. But then in the middle, I have the real general. So I got this guy right here, this guy right here, if you can see those, and Grand Moff Tarkin himself. So, um, anyway, in the back, uh, it's more special troops, you know. Here I got, like, generic stormtroopers, special troops, and then, like, the really good-looking black ones, you know, like uh, black-suited ones. But, you know, I wanted that as a separate display. But the black-suited ones and then the real generals just in the middle. But special forces, we got the ones from the solo battle pack, the immigration uh, control troopers right here and here because those are really special uh you know like they're not massable as much as these but you also got two scout troopers two snow troopers and one of those 80 80 drivers so here's the back of that and the front so the last kind of display is this one which is the sith uh display so you got for and I did a separate whole uh, separate group of stands for the first order by the way. So here's the Sith display. You got four of the Royal Guards, Battle Damage Anakin Skywalker, accompanied by Darth Vader, so his past self, uh, Darth Maul, creepy smile Darth Maul, the new one, and the old 20, 2008, I was about to say twenty eighteen. Twenty eight if people say that, uh Darth Sidious, because you know that skin tone is just way better than the yellow one, but um, let's try to pan out and just get all the stands in there together. So yeah, very simple, though I did have to rummage for pieces because I don't have that many. Uh, if you can say I don't have that many, I do have a lot. But yeah, that is it for this video. I hope you liked it. And if you did, please subscribe and comment down below for more content like this. And I will talk to you again soon. Bye.